Okay, we're in the middle of the construction of the TTV and we're getting to that sequence of steps that I think is kind of critical. So I wanna uh, go through with you now on that. So we're gonna take the tube coupler and you'll notice that it has been laser cut and there's a number of little pieces here that um, aren't used. And what we're gonna do basically is we're gonna take two sections of the tube and we're going to cut this in two parts and we're going to splice them back together to make one long coupler. Um, in a perfect world, uh, we would have loved to have a long coupler, but we only have a short coupler and it's not economical to order a long one for just this one little kit, which is why we have to do this little process here. Um, but what we're going to do is there's these little cutout pieces like here. They, they're kind of like trapezoid pieces. They're not used. Um, so you'll just cut out and remove those. Um, so there's four of those. And then once you cut them, they basically, it falls apart. Um, there's also this little piece here on the end that's not used. And you can take that off as well. Get rid of that. Okay, so that's four of them. Okay, so now um, we're going to take this piece here, um, the longer piece, um, and it's going to be glued um, onto this part here. And yeah, okay, so right here, there's a notch in the coupler and there's a little tab um, that extends on either side of this bulkhead. And we want that tab to go right into that notch right there. And you'll see the same thing on the other side as well. Um, so when you get them right, it should be like that. Um, Okay, so then we're gonna pull this apart and we're gonna put glue here, 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 and here. And we're gonna use wood glue for that. And this is step number seven in the sequence in the instruction sheet. And I just put my fingers in all the glue. <laughs> But notice we didn't put glue on this forward bulkhead and, the, and there's a reason for that is we want to have a little bit of wiggle room um, when we have assembled the other side. So if there's any glue on the outside, make sure you wipe that off pretty quick. Um, and ideally, um, this flat um, eBay sled should be even with the edges of the coupler. I got, I got some glue on the inside of the coupler, but that's not so critical. It's only on the outside because this coupler has to go into the, into the body tube. So I'm just gonna hold that there until it sets nice and firm. And then we'll go on to step number eight, which is to remove part A from the plywood sheet. And I've already gone ahead and snapped it out. And that is going to be glued on the forward end of the sled with the A um, facing towards the sled this way, just like that. And that's gonna get glued right there. Um, 
No, not glue jet. <laughs> but get it ready. <laughs> so in step nine, we're going to take this other coupler here and that is going to be glued on the other side. And again, we're going to put glue on the edges of the sled and then slide it in to there like that. That's like way too much glue. Okay, so here's the important part is we want this coupler here to be nice and straight. So, you know, you can either use a, a sanding tee or on your table, uh, make sure that it's straight across, right across here on the, on the front, at, on this curved surface side. Um, we don't want it crooked, you know, I'll, I'll exaggerate. You know, we don't want it like that because uh, then it's not gonna go into the tube. And so we want to make sure it's straight before we glue it here. All right, so again, can you take any of the glue off? And I'm just going to let that sit um, because I don't, I want to make sure that that's nice while it's straight that the glue grabs and holds. So I'm going to pause and I'll be right back.